What if I told you I have a rich uncle who owns a cruise line and he's inviting people to take a free cruise of a lifetime? That's right, all expenses paid. Day and night paradise at sea. Any takers? Well, I guess you may have a few questions for me first, right? I mean, you probably don't want to sign up just because it's free. You probably want to know, what's the cruise line? When does it leave? And more importantly, where does it go? What will be the food? What about the cabins? Will I be in a suite with a deck overlooking the ocean? Or will I be in one of those cramped rooms down below next to the boiler? Or how about, what will I be doing? Will there be interesting ports of call, exciting shows, entertainment, and fun activities? Or is this a trick to get free labor? Well, you can relax. It's not a trick or bait and switch. It's the finest cruise line available with exquisite dining, an exotic sightseeing, and extravagant lodging. You will not be disappointed. In fact, it's more than words can describe. Let's just say it's to die for. Any takers now? Oh wait, I forgot to mention. There's one more minor detail that may be important. You'll be traveling <clears throat> with my uncle. In fact, you'll be cabin mates. You will eat all your meals together and he will join you for every excursion. Don't worry, he promises he will never leave you nor forsake you. Now, do I have any takers? Something tells me you have another question. Who is your uncle? Can I trust him? Or should I sleep with one eye open? Does he snore? What's he like? Nice? Mean? Weird? Is he a bore? I get it. You are going to want to know everything you can about my uncle before you jump on that boat. I would. Well, you probably realize I don't really have a rich uncle offering free cruise tickets. But I do know of someone offering something far better. We are told in the Bible that Jesus has the authority to give eternal life. Have you ever noticed the questions that are often asked about eternal life? They are similar to my made-up cruise questions. Sometimes eternal life is talked about like it's some kind of eternal heavenly cruise that we take without God. This understanding of eternal life is to miss the boat. Jesus gives us a better question to ask by telling us plainly what eternal life is. In the Gospel of John, Jesus says, Now this is eternal life, that they know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. This focuses our questions not on the what, when, and where of eternal life, but on the who. Who is this true God we will be spending all of eternity with? Jesus is the only one who can tell us. After all, he knows the Father perfectly. As we come to know Jesus, we began an eternal journey of knowing the Father, and he has assured us we won't be disappointed. Any takers? I'm Anthony Mullins, speaking of life. Thanks for watching GCI's Speaking of Life. We hope you enjoyed it and were inspired. We'd love to connect with you, so be sure to like us on Facebook. You can also check out more on our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the most current GCI news. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.